You're going to middle school. That's really great. But moving up from grade school might seem a little scary at first. Maybe you have some worries about what middle school is going to be like. We're here to talk about those worries and let you know that middle school isn't bad at all. At first we were all scared of going to middle school. But now we really like it, and you will too. Middle school seems so big and so different from my old school. I'm afraid I'll get lost. Don't worry, it's easy. You mostly stay in one hall. Teachers and parents will even help you the first week. The teachers are really nice and know that you're just figuring things out. I'm afraid I won't be able to find my classes before the late bell rings. You'll have four minutes to get from one class to another. And the sixth grade teachers won't count anyone tardy for your first week of school. So don't get stressed out. I'm confused. Instead of one classroom and teacher to go to, I have a whole bunch of classes and teachers. Don't worry, you'll be part of a team or house with four or five teachers for almost all of your classes. These teachers will get to know you really well and will help you in many ways. I don't understand my class schedule. Will someone explain it to me? The teachers will explain your schedule the first few days of school and even walk you to your classes until you get the hang of it. You'll understand in no time. I'm afraid there will be too much schoolwork and that it'll be too hard for me. Most kids don't have to spend more than half an hour doing homework each day. Also, teachers have structured study halls and academic hours where they're glad to help you if you have trouble understanding. What happens if I forget my locker combination? You can go to any office in the building and find out the combination to your locker. What happens if my locker won't open? Teachers and custodians will always be glad to help you open your locker. You have to buy a combination lock for your PE locker, so practice with it before school starts. I'm scared that I won't know anybody because I won't be with my friends anymore. Every sixth grader feels that way at first, but you'll still see your friends between class and at lunch. Plus, you'll be amazed at how quickly you'll meet new friends because everyone is looking for someone to talk to. What if no one sits with me at lunch? Lunch is a great time to meet up with friends from your old school and meet new friends because all sixth graders eat lunch together. So don't worry, teachers in the cafeteria will make sure everyone will have a place to sit. I hear we don't have recess anymore. No, you still get a short recess after lunch every day. What about bullying? And harassment. Bettendorf Middle School has a strong anti-bullying procedure. If you see bullying and harassment, report it, and the counselors will do something about it immediately. What about other kids spreading rumors or teasing me? Most of the kids are really nice to each other, but if bullying or harassment does occur, the bullies will receive severe consequences. Our teachers and counselors work hard to make sure everyone is treated with respect and has a safe learning environment. Are we safe from violence and drugs? BMS is a really safe place for kids. We even have a police officer in our building every day who makes sure that everybody makes good choices. Are the eighth graders gonna pick on me? No, the eighth graders have classrooms far away from the sixth grade classrooms. They aren't even allowed in the sixth grade hallways. Well, I hear they shove you in your locker. That's one of those urban legends that never really happens. Some sixth graders even think it's fun to see if they can actually fit in their own locker. What are we supposed to wear? It's important to be yourself. Wear clothes that are comfortable and appropriate, and you'll be fine. Are other kids going to judge me because of what I wear or what I look like? Don't worry, you don't have to wear expensive clothes to have friends and be accepted. Treat people right and you'll have plenty of friends to hang around with. I hear we gotta change clothes in front of everybody for gym class. You do have to change into more comfortable clothes for gym class, but nobody has to take a shower. You might want to take a shower before you come to school, though. What about my cell phone? Cell phones are permitted to be in your locker and turned off until the school day is over. So now we hope you feel a little better. You don't have to worry about going to middle school. We like it and you will too. And we're really glad you're going to be here with us. So...